Secret Lures as a whole has been a great project for us. The, the brand is not necessarily new, it's just our portion of the story is. He comes home one day and uh, he's like, how do you feel about buying a small tackle company? I was like, well, that sounds great. You know, we love fishing and we know we can work together. I was like, why not? At this point, we've been working on it for a couple years and, and we really started with the tube products because we felt like that was the best untold story we have. We have expanded from a handful of colors and two sizes of jig heads up to, well, I think at this point we're at 15 or 17 different colors. We're three different sizes. We're now 12 different jig heads. So we've really had a lot of explosive growth there and, and I still feel like we're just scratching the surface. One day I woke up, I was like, what happened to our little tackle company? It was like, you know, it, it blew up, which is wonderful. It, it's great. Secret Lures has almost 200 unique items. We've got football jigs, we've got a fantastic swim jig, make some good flipping jigs in a few different configurations depending on what you want to do, make some great terminal tackle in terms of shaky heads and the lead shaker. You know, that's, that's a cool product for Kentucky Lake. That particular product has won multiple six-figure events down here. Because we've been able to do tackle, we've made great friends and we've made customers who have become friends and we've got to go places and do things like this. When we can sell a good product to people and they get that same enjoyment that we do, and you get to share that experience with them. I always tell them, it's like, it makes my heart happy. When you can do something you love and it makes you and your partner's heart happy, I, I don't know what else a person can ask for. I just feel really blessed to be a part of this. and. People say, how does it feel to own it? And I just laugh. I say, I don't own Secret Lures, it owns me. It's permeated every aspect of our life and, and I wouldn't trade it for the world.